Sometimes when I'm reporting the news about the economy, I feel like a real Debbie Downer. Unemployment is at more than 9 percent, and the nation lost 300,000 jobs last month alone. That's pretty bad. But there's another way to look at it. That job loss number was about half of what it was in January. And there are some good jobs out there. Industries like retail, construction and finance are taking a beating. But as The New York Times reported today, skilled laborers are in demand. Welders, nurses, engineers, come on down. There's also a need for special ed teachers and respiratory therapists. An employment expert at Challenger Gray and Christmas told us that the news is especially good for people with a few years' experience under their belts. Now, don't get me wrong, we're still in the tunnel, but for the first time in months, it seems like we could soon start to see some light. And I'm very glad to be able to bring you that little bit of good news for a change. That's a page from my notebook. I'm Katie Couric, CBS News.